The quest for this trophy began back in April with 30 sides and four rounds later, we're down to the final two. Salisbury Inter looking to reclaim the cup, which they first won in 2021, and Adelaide Comets, who have already taken out this year's Go Sunny Solar WNPL Premiership and are chasing the treble of the Premiership, the Cup and the Championship. Sugihara gets us away. Nishitani trying to find Signoriello out on the attacking right. Once again uses Katsabas out on the right hand side. It's going to be a fascinating battle between her and Kuimsis. That's a good ball. Penagaris. Penagaris. Twice. Three times denied by Matilda Comley. And I feel like Inter got away with one there. Penagaris finding that little bit of space. Oh. Styles close to the penalty area. There it goes. It's been headed away, but it hasn't got clear. Calder's there, tries to nod it in. There's players at the post, and it's been cleared. Nicola bringing the ball under control for Comets, and she's got some room to move and find Panagaris. But Calder was in the right place. Shot by Yuka Sasaki. Oh, um, very good save by Matilda Comley. That ball was travelling. What a shot. Now... Will this be a direct hit by Carl Kahn? Maybe a bit far, or you never know. Players on the far post. She goes for it. And once again, Matilda Comley acrobatically pushing it away for a corner. There's players in the box. If she can find the right ball. He's the wood. Oh, it's come to Panagaris. Corner. Here's Kira Glins. That ball in board. Battling there. Nishitani wins it off Yuka Sasaki. Dodd wants to get the ball through. Sugihara! Oh, it was a big chance. It was a big chance. And I just wonder, Kote, if she was better off going to the other side of the keeper. Still going. And that ball might have a bit too much on it for Katsabas. Oh, she kept it in. I think she has. Khan! Oh, it was a nice shot. Just opening up her foot, but... Straight at Comley in the end. Yuka Sasaki and Khan, both at the corner. But I think Sasaki will deliver it with her left foot and does. Panagaris, found some says Panagaris! Well, just for a moment, the Salisbury into defence was napping there. Still an opportunity now. Khan. Khan! Oh, another brilliant save by Matilda Comley. That was a good hit. Again, how hitting the ball, you know, outside of the box. And what an amazing shot. To Khan. Sorry, to Nano Sasaki. Now, it's come through. Here's an opportunity for Hazelwood. There's not always a lot left in the box. Now that's a good ball by Styles for Dodd. Roxy Dodd. Styles! Goal kick. Intercepted now. That's given Panagaris something to run on to. And she's in a full race here with Chantel Ryder. Panagaris! Saved again by Comley, who's having an outstanding game. And really. Oh, but it's gone straight to Lattice! Headed away by Calder. Well, I wonder, Cote, if this goes to penalties, some of the Comets players might be wondering if they're going to get the ball past Matilda Comley tonight. Exactly. Hazelwood has a bit of space. Can she find the right ball? Emily Hazelwood still going. Hazelwood! It's a goal! Emily Hazelwood! has scored an absolute beauty for Adelaide Comets, and that might be the goal that decides the Cup Final of 2023. What a great goal, and good on her. She was pushing really hard. Uh, she lost the first, she won it back, and then, you know, that's, that's when you see you won it so badly. She kept trying. For Salisbury Inter, I doubt that they will even have time, even if they get the ball out of this situation to launch an attack. 
Yuka Sasaki goes back to the corner flag. And Adelaide Comets are the 2023 WMPL and WSL Cup Finals. They were made to go the distance. They had to absolutely fight it out against a dogged and determined Salisbury Interside. But in the end, they wouldn't be denied. And Emily Heaselwood's outstanding strike in the second period of extra time has delivered the cup to Ellis Park. And now they are on the brink of a historic treble. Adelaide Comets go into the final series as the top seeds. They've won the premiership. Now they've won the cup. And they're going to have Cote a couple of weeks to enjoy this before they have to come out again to start their finals campaign. But on balance, they probably deserved it tonight.